Hi, welcome back to our channel Shah Computer Education Center. In this tutorial, we will learn how to highlight alternate rows in Google Spreadsheet. There are two different ways to highlight alternate rows. The first one is highlight with the help of alternating colors and second one is with the help of conditional formatting. So, if you want to learn this, watch this video carefully till the end. And if you are new to our channel, please do subscribe to get regular updates and notifications from our channel. So let's begin this tutorial. So to highlight this table, first select this table. Remember, we have a heading that is item name, quantity, rate and amount and a footer that is total of the quantity, rate and amount. So to highlight this with the help of first option that is alternating colors this alternating colors pen appeared here you can see apply to range the range is already selected if this range is not selected then click on this and delete this and select the range that you want then click ok the range is selected number two you can see it is already highlighted with the default styles so here are some color styles if you want to use them click on them you can see the color is changing but if you don't like these colors and want to use your own color just get below and change the header color suppose we want deep blue as heading and alternating color will be light blue you can see we have created and now if you want to put the footer color then click on footer you can see we got the footer color so here footer color is pink so to change the footer color let's go here and click on another color so you can see our header color is deep blue our footer color is light blue and the alternating color are more lighter blue so in this way you can change the colors of the alternating rows and click on done so this is the first way to create the alternating row color this is the easiest way to create the alternating row color but if you want to use the conditional formula then let's go to our another sheet we have the same data here select the data click on format then conditional formatting then here you can use in the custom formula here formula cells if so here we will take custom formula is then within the formula we will type equal to is odd bracket open and then within the bracket we will use a row function we know that a row function give us the row number if the row number is odd then that row will be colored and if the row number is even then that row will not be colored so again bracket close for is odd you can see the odd rows are colored so you can change the color if you want to take red click here you got the red color if you want to take any other light color you can also take that color but if you want to color the even rows then in place of is odd you have to type is even you can see when i put is even now two four six these rows got colored so in this way you have to use the conditional formatting to highlight the alternate rows now at last click done so this is the conditional formula to highlight the alternate rows here we will use another conditional formula so we will add another conditional formatting so click on add another rule 
here go to custom formula and here we will use is e odd equal to is odd bracket open row bracket close and here we will give color light green then click on done you can see odd rows are colored with light green and even rows are colored with deep green so these are the two ways to highlight alternate rows so i hope you understood this video very well if you have any queries regarding this tutorial contact me in the comment section if you have liked this video please hit the like button and do subscribe our channel if you have not yet subscribed thanks for watching this video till the end see you soon in the next tutorial